Hi. Hi, how are you doing? I'm good. Hold the, hold the mic in the center, because this is the receiver, and we won't hold you if we won't. Yes, okay. perfect, perfect. Hi, are you nervous? A little. Why? Because there's a lot of you. <laughs> they don't but bite. I'm just talking to you. Yeah, it's just you just and me, talking. right? We're just going to connect yeah. heart to heart. So, are you psyched? I am. <laughs> Good. So tell us about your business. Um, I'm Rachel Sherwood with ImpressionsFoodStyling.com. Um, I make food look pretty for pictures, for magazines, cookbooks, frozen food packaging. Um, basically make food look great for all sorts of corporate clients. I've done that for nine years now and have been rather successful. Um, but I realized that with doing that, I also get paid to deceive people. Um, and I'm marketing and look at me. Look I'm at marketing me. Yeah. food that I don't believe in, and it's inauthentic with who I am and what's important to me. Um, and that moves you greatly. It does. Tell me about that. Um, well, just because I believe that we should be eating healthy foods, and we should be bringing our families together, and the food that nourishes us also is in relation to our family life and our environment, and it's all interconnected. So with that realization, um, I've realized that I get to move away from some clients and attract new clients. And part of that's opened up some new space for um, a new division of my business called Impressions at Home, which I just came up with this concept a few months ago, so it's so brand new to me. Um, but I'm really excited about it because it touches my heartstrings. Yes. And um, the whole thing behind it is bringing families together. And families or people that you love or your friends, whoever, people that matter to you. Um, so it's really not about the food. It's just that's my medium and that's what I know well and that's how people connect for me. And, um, like even I was sharing with the group that I went to dinner tonight, fabulous, fabulous women of I feel in our society we're getting farther and farther away from that, that things are fast-paced and moving too quickly. Um, but there's the richness of life that is shared when you share a meal together and you come together, that's the learning and the experiences and the laughter. Those are the memories that last for a lifetime. Mm -hmm. So I've created, I'm naturally good at making food look beautiful, but I also have great recipes and techniques and tools and skills to share of creating confidence in the home cook, um, really raising them up and allowing it for them to be feed their families and their friends with ease, that you don't need to know a thousand recipes, you don't need to know how to perfectly entertain and have the proper glassware, that everything that you need to be a success in the kitchen you already have, just working with it a little differently. That's kind of long-winded. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. Who's your buddy in this room? Who's going to take notes for you? Um, Raise your Tracy. hand. Tracy. Tracy? Thank you, honey. Okay, you're going to be her buddy today? So I would... So you, you would be great in front of the camera. Yeah. I know. So when you were telling about the rule of three, yeah. um, there's been two people this weekend and five before I even came that says, well, Rachel, you need to have your own TV show. And it scares the shit out of me. Sorry, I don't think I'm supposed to say that. <laughs> but I also realize that that's part of my fears and my belief and that I get to step into a new space. Yes. So I would like to see... Okay, so I just need to... You may have seen an easing video that I did about this. So if I give her a website to check out... Here, Charles, can you come up here, please? Because you were so yummy last time about this. I just have to say that one time when I did a makeover like this, I said, you should get this website, and I hate to say it. I said, nobody get it if it's available. Somebody, it was available, and somebody in the audience bought it. Oh, That's pretty crappy, right? So, we could tell because they were on the registration list. I was like, that was not too smart. So I'm going to whisper it into your ear, Charles. Charles does amazing websites. Yeah? Woo! Hi, hi. Um, yeah. 
A big hand. <laughs> Charles was on our success panel last time. Last time. Uh, Charles, uh, you did amazingly well in gold, so much so that you signed up for gold again, and then within a couple months, you said, I'm already ready for platinum. And so, go ahead, do you want to say something? You're tall, you get it, yeah. There we go. So I signed up for uh, gold two years ago at this event. Uh, so this is my third uh, mindset Is it really? Uh, event. Third. Yes. Yes. Um, went through the first year with gold. It was amazing. I uh, recouped that uh, scary investment very, very quickly. Um, renewed. The, what was once difficult, now easy, the signing up the first time, I found to be difficult. Renewing it, very easy, very easy. <laughs> and as I renewed it, it, it was so easy, it thought, you know, that kind of raised a little bit of a red flag that, wait a second, this is just too easy, maybe I'm not stretching enough. And so the very first gold meeting in, in my second year of gold, I realized I really need the the additional that the platinum provides. Yes. And so. Uh, and you're thriving, right? Yes. 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 Thank you. Yes. Say your say say your website. Myinternetmarketingpartner.com. Great. So you'll let us know, right? So I have a website for you, and Charles is going to very quickly find out if it's available because it could also be the name of your book and the name of your TV show. Okay. How's that for playing a bigger game? So the rule of three really turned into the rule of like five, uh, eight. Yes. Yes. I guess I had to be told more than three times. Yes. And, um, and when something scares you, it's a good thing. Because, I mean, is she just like a button? Like, I just... Thanks. <laughs> So, have you ever had dreams about this in your quiet moments? Um, yes, several. Yeah. So, so let's talk mindset. Look at me, not them. Okay. What scares you? What's the fear? Tell me for real. Heart to heart. It scares me because it's so big. And then because. Because I know what's in my heart and what I've been gifted, my, my knowledge, the divine gift that I have been given, is that I will change the way that we interact with our families and loved ones. Big time. Rachel, you were entrusted with that calling. Tracy, can you please write that down? She was, Rachel was entrusted with that calling. This was not squandered on you. You were I'm guessing, selected to be the one to do this work. Would you do it for free all day long? Yeah, I already do sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> if you did this all day long for no pay, would your heart be filled with meaning and fulfillment? Yes, because I do it for my friends already, and they ask me for more and more. So I know that I have a whole series of things that's available. Yeah. Is there a great need for this? I believe so. Is there a great need for this? Yes. 
Will you change a little corner of the world if you do this in a very big way? Yeah, I think it's a really big corner. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> I mean, we could just announce it, but what you got? What you got? Okay. <laughs> we've never had, we've never had a, a makeover look like this before. <laughs> we'll get it after. We'll get it after. You're an angel. Thank you, Charles. Well, do you want to just know what it is? Or I could give them a tip while you figure it out. <laughs> don't, don't do it. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. And we, th the thing is, if, if that's not the one, there's so many different little permutations on it. I will. I will. I will. You ask her how old she is. <laughs> how old are you? I'm 28 years old. Perfect, perfect. So, did you do dance or something? Did you study ballet? I was a ballerina when I was a little, little girl. Yes, okay, I can tell. <laughs> so, so, so now, so, so, you've been called. You've had many signs mm -hmm. and coincidences. And it's almost like the very first thing I asked you. And so it just keeps showing up. And it's very, very big. And it sounds like the only thing getting in your way is the fact that it's massively scary. Yeah. Do you think that you're not good enough? Yes, I was discussing that earlier with my fear buddy. All right. I, I'm going to do some advanced teaching. This is what we're going to talk about tomorrow. So we'll revisit it tomorrow because some people aren't in the room. I watched a movie once and doc, uh, called The Moses Code. And Dr. Um, Reverend uh, Michael Beckwith, uh, it's chapter five in the DVD. I know. I've watched it several times. And in that chapter, he says, God does not call the qualified. God qualifies the called who say yes. You do not need to know enough today. The only thing you need to do today is to say yes. Yes. <laughs> and the minute you said yes, the website became available. <laughs> no, literally, literally, I want you to hear this. This is part of the mindset teaching that we'll be talking about tomorrow, but literally, the minute you say yes, you will be qualified because the resources will start coming to you. Remember we talked about this yesterday. A lot of people wait for the how before they say yes to their calling. It doesn't work that way. This is the perfect example. Not, you know, we weren't figuring it out. It was not working. And the minute you said yes, and he stands up. He was my fear buddy earlier. <laughs> was he? Oh, well, there goes another sign. We got to clap to that one. <laughs> so Rachel, at this point, there's a lot of work to be done. Yeah, I know. I need a team. Yeah. <laughs> I've got one. I know. I'm going to sign up for your platinum series. Okay. High five. Because I want you to get the why, okay? This is not just some silly business that we're going to grow, okay? There's a, this, this moves you to tears. This you, would, you do for free all day long anyway. 
Yeah, it's really fun. Yeah, it's really fun and it's really meaningful for you and it changes people's lives because what happens when families eat dinner together? They stay off drugs, they have good friends, they learn something. Um, I think that food is one of those amazing things because it not only is nourishing our stomachs, but it's also a tool that teaches us about art and history and culture and there's so much deeper meaning that's associated with food. It's not just eating to be full, to be hungry. It's feeding the heart and feeding the soul. That's what matters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's something that you can share. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, so with the website that's available, that can also become the name of your book. It can also become the name of your television series. It, did you get it, Charles? You bought it? You bought it, but you didn't buy it yet, right? Oh, you did buy it. Isn't he sweet? He does this. He does this. So now you can tell us, Charles. Creating confidence in the kitchen dot com. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Rachel Sherwood. I'll stop. I'm Rachel Sherwood with creating confidence in the kitchen dot com. Yeah.